thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world, then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Where's nasty Nork? I'll torch him! Keep your horns on, Spyro! You have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Uh... His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Hey, Spyro! Press the jump button twice to glide. And... and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. Cool flash! Do that again! The artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth. But you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Watch the dragonfly, Spyro. His color indicates his power. When he eats butterflies, he stays strong, like me. Uh, sure. Spyro, my friend. How about a hint on gliding? You bet. For the longest glide, press the jump button at the top of your jump and try pressing the action button to drop down mid-flight. When you free a dragon or step on one of their platforms, you're saving your progress. That could be useful if you run into trouble. Not that you ever run into trouble, Spyro. After you've freed all the dragons, pass through this fancy vortex uh, thingamajigger. It'll take you back to the artisan home. But first, let me tell you a story. No thanks. See ya! Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Their metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of them. Psst. Spyro, wanna know a secret? Use the action button when you wanna zoom in and look around. Oh, your secret's safe with me. Big enemies like this Nork with the club cannot be charged, but a quick flame, that should defeat them. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Begin exploring by gliding to that area with the bulls. Use the right stick to get a good look. Thanks, Spyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Did you know that you get your longest glides by pressing the jump button at the very top of your jump? Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. You can always check your progress by accessing the guidebook through the pause menu. Hm. 
Pyro. Did you see a man dressed in blue running around here? He's a thief, and he's stolen a dragon egg. You've got to track him down and, and get that egg. Run, run. <laughs> I'm getting a little winded. Nasty Nork has put one of his most devious henchmen in charge of the artisan world. Bring him on. I think I smell a barbecue. Be careful, Spyro. Toasty has many tricks up his sleeve. Welcome to Peacekeepers. Look how our treasure has been stolen and turned against us. Please, recover our treasure, Spyro. Collect treasure. Got it. Hey, Spyro! Sparks the Dragonfly has been doing a good job protecting you. Make sure to keep him strong by feeding him lots of butterflies. Well done, Spyro. Keep up the good work and I know you'll fulfill your destiny. Destiny? I just want to kick some. Just toast those enemies and collect the treasure. Dr. Shemp thinks he's so cool. You don't know what it's been like listening to him over and over. But I tell you one thing, he should watch his back. Word of caution, little one. Wait until you grow big, <clears throat> like me, before charging those large enemies. Psst, Spyro, some big norks up ahead are wearing armor. And in the ice cave, armor can make their feet very slippery. Hmm. <sighs> Thank you for releasing me. You've done well, Spyro. Some dragons thought you weren't ready, but I knew they were wrong. I'm ready, all right. Uh, ready for what? For freeing me, Spyro. And now, where was I? How's a dragon supposed to flame metal armor anyway? Remember, Spyro, flame won't work on metal, but charging with your horns, well, that should do the trick. What's on the other side of that river? Why don't you glide there and find out? You've reached the highest point in Clifftown. You can get to almost anywhere from here. If I were you, I'd use that whirlwind over there. What? Huh? Oh. Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Dry Canyon rewards good gliders. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I was born to glide. <laughs> Incredible glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those birds might look tough, but they're pretty tasty. Flame broiled with a pinch of salt.
Is that you, Spyro? Are you the young dragon I've been hearing so much about? Ever since you were a wee puff of smoke, we've known, uh... You've known... Ah, uh, I forget. Welcome to Magic Crafters. I want you to release the dragons, reclaim our treasure, and recover the eggs from those pesky blue thieves. When you see arrows like these, you can charge along with them to begin a supercharge. Supercharge? Excellent. Go ahead. Try it. This portal leads to a special place where you can learn to fly. I remember when I was a young dragon, earning my wings. Learn to fly. Got it. Oh, Spyro, you're not afraid of those big, noisy, gigantic, awful beasts, are you? Of course not. Oh, good. I didn't think so. Thank you for releasing me. Great work, Spyro. If you keep this up, you'll learn all the tricks of the Magic Crafter's world. Remember that these blue thieves have stolen eggs outside the Magic Crafter's world as well. Don't worry, I'll take care of them. Please do something about these green druids. They insist on moving everything in sight. I hate those bugs. When I become big and strong like you, I'll squash them all. Until then, remember that supercharge makes you invincible. Try combining your supercharge with jumping and gliding, and really explore the high caves. Welcome to Wizard Peak. This is my favorite supercharged spot. Use it to bash those wizards. Well done, Spyro. Thank you for releasing me. Listen carefully, Spyro. There's a secret area in the artisan's home world near the waterfall. Try jumping on the stones there. Artisan's home world? Waterfall. Sounds good. Thanks for releasing me, Spyro. You have no idea how long I've been trapped in Crystal. And, uh, neither do I. Who are you again? Um, I'm out of here. Nasty Nork is turning our swamp into an electrified junkie. <sighs> and it used to be so beautiful. I'm sure it was. It's great to see you, but I gotta go. Watch out, Spyro. The Norks in these parts have discovered the power of electricity, and it really stinks. Good 
job, Spyro. One day you'll be able to tell all the dragons about your amazing adventures. Sure, but what I'd really like to do is get out of this swamp. Be on the lookout for attack frogs. They are cold-blooded killers. Attack frogs? And this used to be such a nice swamp. Thank you for releasing me. I'll tell you what to do with those creatures. Smash them, Spyro! Stamp them out and squish them and squash them! <laughs> uh, how about charge them and flame them? We are dragons, after all. Thanks for releasing me. It seems like I've been trapped in here since I was your age. Oh, no! Why, I remember... Uh, uh gotta go! Greeting, Spyro. For an amazing tour of the treetops, don't just stop at one supercharge. Huh. Spyro, if you jump at the end of a supercharge ramp, you can really go far. I'm all over it. That was quite a ride, Spyro. You learned a lot since you were a young glider. Yeah, well, you could have found an easier spot to get stuck. Metalhead is all charged up to meet you. Attacking the power pole should disrupt his power supply. Hello, Spyro. Nicely done. I'll be done when I've toasted that nasty Nork. The fools you see in this world are invincible. But that does not mean they shouldn't be attacked. Sounds all right to me. Welcome to the Dreamweavers, young one. While chasing Nasty's minions in this world, you must expect the unexpected and prepare for what is not there. Berries are always on your side, Spyro. Thank you for releasing me. Ah, Spyro, thanks. Supercharge will get you to new places here in Lofty Castle, too. See where it takes you. Hey, Spyro. All dragons know there's magic in a fairy's kiss. See what it can do to your power of flame. Hold your horns. Here comes Spyro. Patience, little one. You'll soon have the opportunity to battle the one who matters most. Nasty Nork. You've become a master of the supercharge. Great work!
The enemies here can be quite frightening, but you should watch the fools. I'd rather flame the fools. Now you're thinking. Thank you for releasing me. You know, I think you just might be the dragon to defeat Nasty Nork. That's me, all right. Thanks, Spyro. I'd love to help you catch Nasty, but I'd really hate to be trapped in Crystal again. Don't worry. The only one that's gonna be trapped is him. Thank you for releasing me. Any advice before this battle? Advice? Hmm. A wise dragon once told me aim high in life, but watch out for flying boxes. Uh, huh? Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Take care. Hey, didn't I already free you? You're in Nasty's world now, Spyro. And you are the dragon that must defeat him. Bring him on. I'm ready. Reach the exit in each of Nasty's lands. Then you can challenge the Nork himself. Keep up the good work, Spyro. I expect Nasty's really starting to worry about you. I'd be shaking in my Nork boots if I were him. Wow, I never thought I'd be rescued, especially by such a little dragon. Uh, uh, what I mean is, I always believed in you, Spyro. You gotta believe. <laughs> Thank you for rescuing me! Be on the lookout for no Commando, Spyro! They better be on the lookout for me! <laughs> Nasty's ancient history now! So, what's in there? I believe this is Nasty's treasure hoard, but the gate will only open if you have found everything in the Dragon Kingdom. Come back when you have reached 100%. <laughs> 